all right without further ado let's just begin and uh yeah you know i haven't actually reacted to hip-hop in a long time our music uh, the previous one was actually sorry not react i did react recently to knox hills north face but i don't listen to rap music very much anymore so just a little bit of something to keep in mind let's go this is a battle dance by the way i mean a dance battle <laughs> I say something. <laughs> I don't know what the whole ay 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 is all about. Um, it's just, I find that kind of, yeah, you know, coming from me, that's not meaning very much. But uh, I mean, I like the support. Oh, the, there's a there's a real crowd. It's, you know, if you're gonna say things like ay ay ay, that's better than than dead silence. It's a good crowd, a very supportive, cheering, all that kind of stuff. Um, again, I think the reason why it's off-putting is probably because the dance itself just isn't that great right now. There's, they always start off slow, right? It, there, I think I can see the smoothness in, I think, I'm not, I'm not sure who this is, is this M2, MA2T or Jimmy Boone Clap? I don't know. But whoever's dancing right now, he's got some real, he's real slick with it, right? He's smooth. And I think uh, he's capable of a lot more than what he's giving off right now, which is very abstract and... Um, not my cup of tea, but we'll see. I have faith. Yeah, it's simple moves, but you can see that he's able to control his body very well. Demonstrating a lot of control. They're both smooth, but they both can have quite a bit of control. I can see that their styles are quite similar. This guy's is a little bit more unorthodox. <laughs> Not laughing, yes. Believe me, I couldn't do anything. I can come close. Alright. Oh, let's just switch up. It's ramping up a bit. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. Just trying to feel it. Again, a lot of simple movements, but they're very fluid. Ooh, ooh, you see that? He did that effortlessly. Let's go back again. That's why. That's that's one of the things you know. When you're doing this uh, sort of dance, it's I think quite important to do it strategically. Not that I would know, right? This is something that I always have no idea what the hell I'm talking about here. That they would understand, but timing is perfect, right? Um, it's always a real treat to see someone go through a, a particular phase of simplistic movements and then be able to effortlessly effortlessly punch out a complicated dance move um a twirl and a slide without making any real because it just stands out it pops it's like oh it's like oh shit <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, you see that footwork there. Let's go back. Hype each other up. Okay. There was another thing about attitude as well, by the way, uh, about how um, in hip hop, you know, I get in your space, now you push me back out, and you go back in my space, and I push you back out, right? So this back and forth dynamic, because hip hop is inherently supposed to have some aggression. So there's something about the dance, about having banter, right? Being able to stand your ground. Twist there. He's going for some sort of imagery. Ooh. Spins and twirls. I noticed this guy when he dances. What, what's really um, bugging me a little bit is uh, his lower back is kind of arched like this. Right, uh, I'm not. I ha kind of have a bit of that problem. I don't like it myself. Like his back is kind of like arched on the lower back. He dances. It makes it look kind of. Uh, it's like a, a weird, like sassy kind of movement. Uh, that's one of those things that kind of uh, irks me. So I'm not always going to be. I'm going to be real, right? When I talk about, when I react, I'm going to say point out some things I like, some things I don't like as well. Um, but it's not like a, it's a big deal for me. Um, you like what you like. You don't like what you don't like. Um, as far as I'm concerned, overall though, um, I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying their dance, right? Because the, the the most important thing for me right now is just that the atmosphere is very welcoming. Like uh, both of them are having, they're enjoying themselves, and then everyone else is around is is, is having a good time. Um, without question, that's always going to be that top of my mind. And I know that makes it like, oh, you're so boring. Uh, that's kind of, mm, it is, but that's who I am, I guess. Um, I've never been particularly conflict um, oriented for most of my life so I am being true to myself to a degree here um, and yet I do I, I really love conflict at the same time so it's a it's a it's a real mix it's a juxtaposition you you love and hate the same thing um, so there's some suppression here going on let's not psychoanalyze too much get back into it Okay, it's getting aggressive now, I guess. Ooh. Yeah, there we go. Alright, they're gonna get into it now. Let's see what you got. Step up to the plate. Knock says. Ooh. He's feeling it. There's something robotic. There's something robotic about this dance as well. So I noticed that there is some, it's like a little bit of a techno kind of, right? Um, so there's a, there's some, some of that is being manifested in this guy's dance right now. He's, uh, at certain times, it's like a smooth robot. Kind of reminds me a little bit like, a, you know, what Jabberwockies would do. I'll, I know it's not on the same level, but you know, it's still, give kudos where it's due and uh it's like a, a smooth walking robot and he is hitting the beats um not very aggressively uh like we would expect because this is actually i think it's clear that it's just his style that uh he just doesn't do or both of these people both of these dancers are more into the smooth uh flowing and fluid dance than they are into like the heavy lock and pop so it's interesting it's different it's something that I'm not usually um, that much into. What am I saying? Uh, it's something that I was into at one point, but have fallen out of. That's more accurate. Yeah. 
NBA hoodie. Looks like a simple move, but the fact that you could do it effortlessly is what's what really counts is that you just went into it easy. Something I noticed about their dances here, again, both of them, they don't accelerate really much. Well, that guy, the other guy here just did something that was a little bit, uh, they're not, they're not accelerating into any moves and decelerating quickly. Uh, it's very fluid and, uh, constant, constant movement that is well conducted. It's not disjointed. And, uh, but then it also takes away some aggression, obviously. <laughs> Uh, speaking of aggression, <laughs> making me eat my words. <laughs> right, it's it's clear that the movements themselves have do less with uh, the energy and more with the the, the tactic, the strategy. What are, what is the nature of their doing? Um, I'm using really shitty words here. I'm losing my vocabulary. If I had a better way to describe it, it's more like the choreography is is, is speaking. Oh, yeah, following the beat, okay. <laughs> it's always fun when they do that, when they do that kind of, uh, you know, uh, crack the neck. Uh, okay, oh. See, it's all love again. That's nice. Okay, that's a little long. That's a little long. Okay, but yeah. Nice. Okay, cool. We're done with that one. Uh, that was a good thing I just wanted to kind of knock out, honestly. Because <laughs> I want to watch it, right? And then it's like, oh, oh, Azula, after war ended. She looks pretty evil now. Okay, it's cool. All right, let's let's get to the comments. Uh, let's get to comments, comments, calmness. With Boom Clan remains special. Great exchange, battle, talented dancer, and the rhythm gods. M A two T. Joy. Organic. Nice. And I should leave a comment as well. You know, it's like I don't know what should we say. Smooth. And fluid from both dancers. Loved. Loved. Uh, all love. At the end. <laughs> I want to say something like it's a little too long of a hug. Uh, show or oh, uh, you know despite battle dance Put emoji. Laugh.
I should refer to the name, right? I guess it's kind of like. Sportsmanship. Battle dance. Uh, it's like being known for what's it being known for? Known for aggression. Okay, that's it. That's our comment. And uh, yeah, there. Gonna paste that somewhere. And now we're gonna move on to oh, the Greater Uniter Way. We're going to try to basically comment every video that we react to and show some engagement to the creators. I think that's fair. Okay. Cool. So I think it's about time to end this reaction. I know it wasn't something that I, I particularly got real into. I wasn't heavy into the dance or whatever. Um, but it is what it is. You know, there's no no problem with that. Great dancers, great interpretations from both of them. Um, not my cup of tea though when it comes to the first couple of dances they were slow um and that's despite the fact that they were very articulate right i just didn't like it um I, i'm just gonna be honest didn't like it um but around the middle things started to pick up a little bit things got a little more interesting a bit more unique and again i'm not stuff i'm not in a place to judge at all like my dancing is probably real shit compared to them for sure like i'm not a dancer right i probably dance like a like a dead worm you know so a worm could probably dance better than me at least could do the worm <laughs> if you catch that <laughs> so that was dumb all right so let's put an end to this and move on to a studio gap reaction we want to probably review uh we're gonna go cover like five minutes of what the, what we left off oh oh another thing before we go to studio gap and record a reaction to them we also want to uh put some lay down some comments to some of the videos we put out like 10 11 reaction videos no so we did like eight reaction videos eight or nine reaction videos so far and and two like behind the scenes vlog type real life reality and introduction uh yeah i'm supposed to look up here i'm supposed to look up there type re type videos and uh the problem is i didn't really engage with the videos i didn't actually go on and comment on my own videos to leave like a bit of an introduction you know uh, what did you think? How you guys go? Leave comments, that kind of stuff. I didn't do that. And on top of that, more importantly, I didn't engage in the other uh, reactions, uh, the the actual source videos. Like I wanted to actually leave a comment there as well, and kind of like leave a mark. It's like a little timestamp saying, "Hey, I was there. I watched this. I made something out of it," and then move on. But instead, right now, I'm just creating stuff myself without leaving any sort of, you know, trace that that's where it came from. I like to give some something back a little bit at least to the not that it's going to make it make much of a difference to leave a comment there but it's it's like a, just a, an, a part of the experience right it's like you're getting a more comprehensive experience when you actually engage with other people's work instead of just making something uh, that refers to it you actually engage and you go and you you taste their food and you comment on it and you know you leave a rating and stuff like that right so that's uh just trying to get more out of it you know so that's what we'll do probably before we move on to the studio get reaction, which we have to start. We don't have a choice. We have to start it um, today. So, yeah, overall great dances. Um, I didn't like the first two because it was just slow, and that's just me, right? I just didn't. Right now, I'm probably more into a slightly more disheveled. I can see I'm a total fucking mess. So I like more aggressive stuff right now, but uh, that's okay. That's all right. And I really love the end. At the end, the sportsmanship of them just hugging it out, and uh, even throughout the whole dance, I want to say I want to comment on this slightly. They, they were there were all these glances, you know, they throughout they were they were really supporting each other more than they were like um, like there, there was some slight, you know, like, for example, when I don't know who this who he is, is he M MA2 or Jimmy, but he came over to the side and did a spin twirl around him to try to, you know, bring out 
you know, something, uh, bring out some competitiveness out of him, uh, some banter, right? And then he came over and he did that thing with the head, you know, with the locking of the head. Can you see my hands? There we go. Right, just pulled it out. But through and through the entire dance, there was always just a lot of respect going on. Um, I know it's that makes it more tame. I, I recognize that that's probably part of the reason why I'm bored. I'm more, uh, I'm more familiar with the old school, you know, like eight mile type tearing each other to pieces. Although eight mile was like a battle rap, it's not dance, but you get the idea. Uh, I guess you could say les twins, right? The from France, they are more aggressive by a large, wide margin. Uh, their style is just different, though. So, anyways, a lot of what I saw here. Uh, I do know that there was a point in my life which I would have really, really enjoyed this. Um, and to a degree, I still do. So that was nice. All right, let's put this to wraps. Let's leave some comments on some of the videos that I should have left comments on, and then we'll get into the studio get reaction. So, yeah, peace out. See you there. Yeah, the camera's there. Camera's there. <laughs>